This is Mark Topkin of the Tampa Bay Times with today's Rays report. The Rays hung on and beat the Pirates 4-2 on a cold afternoon here in Bradenton, improving to 9-4 on the spring. Alex Cobb was very sharp once again, starting for the Rays, uh, mixed all of his pitches, incorporated a cutter today for the first time, said he got good results with that. Cobb went four innings, one hit, no walks, five strikeouts, was very pleased overall with, with what he did and how he did it. Uh, next pitcher was Chris Archer. A little bit of struggle at one point, but ended up with a pretty solid outing. Just talked to Archer, and he said what he took out of this the most was kind of overcoming that adversity and still having a good outing. Uh, felt pretty good about his stuff overall. Jake Odorosi finished up, gave up a couple runs, but overall three uh, pretty good young arms by the, uh, on display for the Rays today. Offensively, a lot of good at-bats up and down throughout the lineup. Manager Joe Madden had said before the game that Mike Fontenot had been very impressive. He really hadn't had a bad at-bat all spring and came up uh, today in a key situation and delivered uh, overall. And the Rays pretty much hitting the ball a little bit better than they typically have. Uh, off to a good start this spring. A lot more contact, which is one of the goals. Injury updates. Luke Scott should be back early next week, according to Joe Madden. Uh, his left hamstring tightness is sideline him since Sunday. Sam Fold, however, will be out until the end of next week, although that should not impact his position on the team, according to Madden. Just a matter of being uh, precautionary since Fold does so much running. Reporting from Bradenton with photographer James Borchuk, this is Mark Topkin for the Tampa Bay Times. Follow our coverage all spring on Twitter at tbtimes underscore rays and on the Heater blog on the newly redesigned TampaBay.com.